Hi, my name is Talia. I'm with Stern Pinball, and today we're going to go over a solenoid or coil test. To start off, we're going to open up our coin door and pull out our interlock switch to enable our 48 volts. Our first step to enter the coil test will be to press our black button. You will see this screen that says service menu. We will go ahead and press the black button again. And then you will see the diagnostics menu and we will select the first flashing tab. We will then press the red plus button in order to scroll over to the coil tab. Once we reach the coil tab, we will go back and press our black button and we will see the test tab flashing. This is where we want to focus. So we will select this again by pressing the black button and you will see on the screen it says coil test. Once we are inside the coil test, we will do an example. Let's focus on the left slingshot. What we have to do here is press the red plus button in order to reach our left slingshot. You will see on the screen how it changes to auto plunger. We press the red plus button again. We see left flipper. We press it again until we reach the left slingshot. You can see that I have reached the left slingshot and it shows us that it is number five. This is important because when we go back to our manual, you will see that during the coil test or solenoid test, the left slingshot is numbered as number five. Now, in order to test the left slingshot coil, we will press the black button. You can press it a couple of times and you will see that left slingshot fire. Another option you can do is the coil cycling test. And I'm gonna show you how to get there. We're gonna press our green button once to exit out of this single coil test. And then we will press the red plus button in order to reach the cycling coil test. You will then proceed to press the black button and we will enter cycling coil test. So the purpose of the cycling coil test is that it will go through each individual coil on your game and you will hear each of them fire. In case you have any issues, you will not hear that coil fire. And that is how you perform a single coil test and a cycling coil test. You can check out our other tech videos at sternpinball.com.